The Kerala government has confirmed that 10 people who died in the last week had Nipah virus encephalitis, a rare but emerging infectious disease. Though it has killed 10, the Kerala Health Department says there is no outbreak of the disease yet. But what do we know about Nipah? The World Health Organization calls Nipah a newly emerging zoonosis, which is a disease that can be transferred from animals to humans. It was first identified during an outbreak in Kampung Sangai Nipah in Malaysia in 1998, which is where its common name also comes from. Nipah causes fever and cold-like symptoms in its patients that quickly advance to encephalitis, which is the inflammation of the brain, and myocarditis, which is the inflammation of the heart. Because its symptoms are similar to Japanese encephalitis, it has in the past been mistaken for that disease. Currently, there is no vaccine or cure for Nipah infections, and treatment is restricted to intensive supportive care of patients till the symptoms subside. The virus's natural host is a fruit bat, although the virus has also been spread through pigs. The infection spreads from fruit bats that drink sap of date palm trees to people who drank raw date palm sap as toddy. The Nipah virus cannot be spread through air. Instead, it is transmitted through contact of bodily fluids. Anyone who is suspected of having the disease should be isolated right away, since even coughing or sneezing could transmit the infection. After first emerging in Malaysia, Nipah has seen multiple outbreaks in Bangladesh with a number of fatalities. There have been two outbreaks in India, both in West Bengal districts close to Bangladesh. 71 people were infected in these two outbreaks, with 50 dying. The health department and doctors in Kerala say there is no need to panic, since there is no outbreak yet. Bangladesh's experience with the disease has been to see more infections from December to May, stopping when the rain arrives, which is a positive sign for Kerala that the monsoon is around the corner. While there is hope this disease may be contained, India has another bigger healthcare headache.